Good morning, Audacious Church. My name's Paul Reed. I'm part of the team here at Audacious Church, as I'm sure some of you know, but for those of you that don't, hello. Proverbs 11, 24 says, the world of the generous gets larger and larger. We've been looking at how we as a church can own it all week, thinking about the vision that God has given to us as a church. So as we come to our vision party this Sunday, I want you to consider the power of our togetherness. Look at this Old Testament verse with some seemingly bad maths. Deuteronomy chapter 32 verse 30 says, how could one person chase a thousand of them and two people put 10,000 to flight? unless their rock has sold them, unless the Lord has given them up. Now, we generally understand that if one equals a thousand, then two should equal two thousand. But this verse somehow challenges that. God is highlighting several things to us in this verse. And if we had the time, we could look at all of them. But in these few minutes, let's just focus on the one which is the power of the multiplying effect of our agreement. Now we know that from Matthew 18, that where two or more come together in agreement, God is not only there, but also he's ready to act. Matthew 18, 19 and 20 says this, this is Jesus speaking. It says, I'll also tell you this, if two of you agree here on earth concerning anything you ask, my Father in heaven will do it for you. There's God ready to act when we come together. And then it says, For where two or three gather together as my followers, I am there among them. There's God's presence with us. So when we come together in agreement, he's both with us and willing to act. So we have an opportunity this Sunday to operate either in our own understanding of how things work, our own maths, or we can trust God and know that his ways are higher than our ways and that he will do more with our coming together and giving to him than we could ever do on our own. We are believing for an increase in resource that will match our ever-increasing vision. As a church, we've always bitten off more than we can chew. But we've also always seen God miraculously multiply whatever seed we've sown into his kingdom through our faithful generosity in giving. So it really is time to own it when it comes to the vision that God has given us for our church. It's time to lift our faith and then bring our faith on Vision Sunday this weekend. We come together, he multiplies. This whole season, not just the Vision Day, but this whole season up to Christmas represents one of those all rise moments for the church, where we as a whole church bring our faith, we bring our resource, we bring our families, we bring our friends to the house of God to see what he can do. All right, let's do this together. I will see you on Sunday.